Okay, everything's everybody, welcome back to another episode of Series Cruise Adventures in Zelda Twilight Princess HD. We finally met Zelda itself, but it is time to leave this place before the before the guards show up. Not that way, the guard's coming. Boy, he's prompt. <laughs> well, do you understand where we are now? Yes, I do. I guess a promise is a promise, so I'll let you go back to where you first stumbled into Twilight. But are you really sure you should be going back? Are you sure you aren't forgetting anything important? That's creepy. <laughs> do you want to save them? Well, in that case, Little Midna would be happy to help you. But, there's always a but. Well, you'd have to be my servant, and like a servant, you'd have to do exactly as I say. Why don't you go back, take a little time, and give it some thought. Oh, that's right, I forgot to mention one thing. Though you may have left the darkened realm, you haven't transformed back to your former self. And you won't anytime soon. Now why could that be? <laughs> See you later. She's so sneaky. Well, here we are again. I guess being a wolf right now is not the best thing. So, um, what next? That sound effect, by the way, is my phone's notification sound effect. So every time it rings in this game, I just freak out and think I'm getting a message or something. <laughs> it's so weird. Anyway, hehehe. <laughs> Did you think I disappeared? Listen, there's another thing I forgot to tell you. Don't think you can just run off and save your friends, because you can't. Just beyond that bridge, the land is covered in twilight. Last time, a shadow beast pulled you through uh, the curtain of twilight. But if you want to go that way this time, uh, you need the cooperation of someone from the twilight, like me. So you really have no choice but to do what I say. Saving your friends and all that, well, that will depend on your actions. She should really sell like life insurances or something. Because you never can trust words, you know. Right now, I want a sword and a shield that will suit me. You do understand me, don't you? <laughs> so what do you plan to do while you're here dawdling the twilight continues to expand? Come on, hurry up! Okay, I guess we have to go on a shopping spree for our Miss Midna. Oh, hello. You're new. I'll just eat you. How about that? That worked. So luckily we know where we can sort of find a sword and a shield, I guess. We know there's a wooden sword somewhere, and we saw a uh, a wooden shield in one of the houses. So might as well go there and try to grab it. I love the jump attack. It's like two hits with a jump attack, but I think it's like... Yeah, see, with a normal attack, uh, you need twice as much, I think. Twice as many hits. Wait! Oh, hello. Oh, animals talking to us. Thank you for taking care of those bad guys. They made both the village and the forest a mess. They gave them the village children. But I know, you're not one of them. I can tell because you smell like trees of Auden. If you run into any trouble, try talking to the animals. We animals understand one another, so you'll be alright. Okay, sounds good.
Oh, how did it come to this? The children, please say nothing happened. Please forgive for your good for nothing, father. Oh, I guess the children's are gone, huh? Interesting. It is nighttime, even though it's still kind of bright. Um, it's, it's pretty... I guess it's nighttime. So the sword was from this family here, right? But obviously we can't use the door. So that's no help. Hello, chicken. Can I talk to you? Yes. Ah! To be a wolf on a night when the moon rides. Beautiful. Tell me, is it true from a human who is not currently in the town? <laughs> no, just teasing. You're lucky, your sharpened accents and your soft looking coat. Lovely. Okay. Crazy chickens. There's stuff to dig. Oops. Wrong button. Uh, looks like we can actually dig through here to get inside our house. Interesting. Anyone home? Oh, look at these fishing rods. Can we just steal them? Nope, no one here. No sword here. Hmm, okay. I guess we leave then again. I like the picture on the wall. You know, if you like dicks with his wands, why do you have to do it twice? Shouldn't there be like a big hole now or something you can just go through? Oh, little frogs. Look at those. Rabbit. Rabbit. I didn't think anyone would come uh, come calling, so I haven't thought of anything to say. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Well, it's a... Uh, I guess it's a valid reason. There's another chicken here. Huh? Fresh face, huh? You're a sharp one to realize that you needed to come introduce yourself to me, Bok. If you want to know anything about this town, I can tell you what you want to say. Sure, tell me. Let me tell you. This is usually a quiet little village, Bok, but there was a bit of a ruckus today. If you gotta know, once this attacked the village and made off with a lot of rats. You look uh, you look a bit like a monster yourself. If you're gonna be hanging around town, you may want to stay out of sight of the people. Okay, that's a good tip. Stay away from people, like that one up there, I'm guessing. Maybe those people. Oh, about that shield. Oh yeah, yes. Hey, not so loud. No, no, tell me. Can we listen to them? I came to it as we discussed. Oh, that's too quiet. Can't quite re hear it yet. I checked as we discussed. Mm, almost there. S still sneaky. So, that shield is still in your house, right? Uh, yeah, it should be in our storage loft. Good. Go grab it, quick as you can. Russell got wounded pretty bad, so he can't go search for the kids. Oh, no, that's bad. I'll take over for him. But Russell had a sword, Mayor, and he still got hurt. If you are unarmed, you're done for. I'll be fine. The sword we were going to present to the royal family should be still at Russell's house. Oh, yeah? All right, I understand, Mayor. I'll hurry up and get that shield. You just wait here. Then we just came from Russell's house, though. No good. Run. Oh, they saw us. That's not a bad bit of information you heard, huh? Uh, look at that open window. This village is full of idiots. <laughs> wow. So... We should jump up there, but from where? Hmm. Oh, little puppy doggy. Oh, the wolves are so nice, aren't they? I hope I find something good for him today. I love digging holes and looking for treasures. Use the egg sensors and use Y to dig where you see anything strange. You dig something up. Thanks, crazy dog. Is the cat here? No, the cat is probably inside. Maybe. I'm not sure. Okay, so we need to go to the water wheel somehow. I'm a monster! Not a monster, I'm a wolf. You've returned for more, haven't you? My my daughter, return her and take this. Oh, oh, he's calling the hawk. No, not the hawk. Okay, those ominous dark clouds suddenly in the background are a little bit spooky. Okay, he missed. <laughs> Suck it. Mm, he, he might be a problem. Can I climb this? Probably not. Oh, hello, cat. Hey, you are. Were you attacked by that hawk? You're no match for him. I'm sorry, the person calling the hawk is my master's husband. 
You could sneak out from behind and scam. Meow. Okay. How do we do that? We need to get on this roof, I think. Um. Hmm. How do we get on that roof? Unless we can, like, climb. Yeah, I don't think we can climb, though. No. You smell the same as the ranch hand named Link. Uh, so I know you're a nice wolf. Thanks. I'm sorry, the person co- Okay, yeah. I know. Okay, how do we get up there then? Is that cat following me now? Oh, Midna. Midna knows. Come on, let's get up on the roof from here and scare that guy. Look at him, posing like he's all important. Wait until he sees us. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah, I need her help. Can't jump that high on my own. Cats be- Oh. Glad this wolf can hang on things. Let's be all sneaky. And wah. That showed him. And he vanished. Like magic. Mysterious. Oh, we can howl now. Okay. So we can use left stick to like adjust the pitch and then hold A to howl. So, you're Link, right? Sorry about giving you so much trouble before. I'm not proud of it, but it's in my genes to obey anyone who blows a reed. How sad. <laughs> that is kind of sad. Your voice. It sounded like a reed. That's why I flew down. I'll tell you what. Next time call me like uh, like that when you need something. Who knows? I might be able to help you out. His wings are really loud, though. Okay, that's good to know. Thank you, Mr. Hawk. Aha, now we can jump over here too. Time to steal a shield. It's right there. Gotta need someone's help. Hehehe, <laughs> found it, found it. Thanks, Midna. That didn't work. <laughs> here we go. Okay, let's get the shield. Hold down, come on. Got it. You learn telekidneys! Now, you got the Auden Shield. Press it L to defend yourself, but beware. If it's touched by fire, it will burn. Good to know. It looks kind of cheap. Alright then. Next is a thought. Hurry up and get one. In case she doesn't like it, huh? I like how just Link has it on the back of his. Well, back, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> looks kind of cool. Okay, we need to get out of here. Oh, I actually have to stay up there. I think the window is open. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Wrong button. The, uh, like, calling Midna and then aiming at her always confuses me a little bit. What was that sound? The children could not have returned, could they? I must go out and search one last time. You get inside the house. I have placed a thaw uh, sword that was to be our gift to Hyrule on the couch. If the mayor comes for it, please give it to him. But darling, your injuries. Okay. So, well, they're back home, so we know where to get the sword this time. We were at the right place, just not at the right time. Okay, he is trying to get down here. We can probably just go around. Luckily, he's super blind. Let's just assume that it's actually extremely dark and he can't see us. Sure. Here we go. Can we also steal some of these fishing rods while we are at it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> you got the Orden Sword. This is a sword crafted by Russell, the best swordman in Orden, as a tribute to the royal family. Alright, now you have a sword. Looks like you can actually be useful when you concentrate. Alright, no more detours. I'm going to take you back into the twilight. Go back to the woods where you first transformed into that shape. All right, I shall do that. I have to obey. I have to do what she says, apparently. So, 
What choice do I have, really? Goodbye, chicken. Thanks for all the tips and such. Okay, where's the guy? He is standing there. He is <laughs> he's not looking great. To be fair. He is really hurt, and I do feel bad for him. Like You know, all the kids are gone. He got injured in the fight, trying to protect the village and the children probably. And we were just gone. I mean it wasn't our fault, but you know. It happens. Okay, so we have to go back to the pond, right? I think. Or was it the gate? No, it was the gate at the end on the other side. Because it pulled us through there. I could also dash just to be a little bit faster. Wait. Oh. Come to my spring. You have been transformed by the power of shadow. Come to me. That looks like a trap. Beware. A shadow beam. It approaches. This effect looks amazing. I was really impressed back then when I, when I saw it the first time. Okay. We can deal with this, right? Oops. Oh, that was easy. And change colors. Same colors as Midnight's. Oh, brave use. I am one of four light spirits that protect Hyrule at the behest of the gods. I am Odona. The black beast he slayed was a shadow being. It had come to seize the power of light I wield. My brethren in Hyrule have already had the light stolen by these fell beasts. The entire kingdom has been reduced to a netherworld, ruled by the cursed powers of darkness. The blight will not stop with Hyrule. Before long, the entire world of light will fall into the hands of the king who rules the twilight. save this land from the king of twilight the lost light must be recovered the three light spirits who have lost their light must be revived there is but one who can who can revive them and redeem this land you You still have not discovered your true power. Those transformed by twilight usually cannot recover their original forms. 
unless if you were to return to Farron Woods where you were first transformed if you were to revive the light spirit there by the power of the light spirit you may find the means to regain your other state of being Okay, sounds good, crazy spirit. How oh, and this pool is recharging our health. I used to know a lot about like the background story about all these uh, the gods and what happened here and such. I don't remember most of it. I probably should uh, <laughs> refresh my my knowledge on that a little bit for next time or something. It's a really interesting story. Hey, look, the Farron Woods that you know so well, they're now covered in twilight. You might be able to come back here, but do you still want to go? Yes. Well, that's one way of entering, I guess. This place definitely looked a little bit happier before. <laughs> hmm, so these are weapons uh, you use in your world? I don't think that's how you use a shield, but I guess maybe. If you're really careful, if you really want to prote protect your face, I guess. You really think the thing can slay the creatures of Twilight? Well, I won't use these, but I'll hang on, uh, hang on to them for you. Great. At least I don't have to carry them. Alright, a promise is a promise. I trust you enough to help. In exchange for my help, though, I need you to gather some things for me. Look, I can't tell you all the details now, but it will be easy. Trust me. I don't, I don't know if I should really trust her. But enough about that. Do you hear that noise? It's the lamentation uh, of the spirit that had its light stolen. Where the world could it be? <laughs> Better get going, don't you think? Don't blame me for your world's fate if you don't hurry up and find the light. Come on, snap to it. Seriously, Link, let's get going. It's about time. Farron Woods. So spooky. Sort of cool. Can also use this mod again. Probably find something to dig here, but... I don't know, I usually don't do that a lot, because you really don't find too many useful things. It's good when you like get hearts to refill your health, but we don't get hearts in this version, so yeah. Another battle. But this time, three. Oh, okay. We could deal with three people, right? Aw, we're penned in again. Pfft. Who do you think they're dealing with? No need to take these little pests on at, uh, one at a time, right? You can take them all at once. So, you can handle this by yourself, can't you? Good luck, bye. Okay. And she just runs away. We can do that. It's easy. Just jump from guy to guy. And uh, kill them. See, one down. Two down. Oh, that's something's happening. And they got revived. So yeah, there's a gimmick. Um, as these guys have to die at the same time. Not at the same time necessarily, but the last. Like if one of them remains alive while the other ones are dead, then they just get revived. If you leave the last one alive, it's just going to use that shriek to bring the others back. Listen, let me help you out here. Just move like I tell you. 
Just hold down the B, uh, down B, and I'll expand an energy field. So enclose all the enemies within it and release. Oh, that sounds useful. Could have done that the first time. Oh, and there we go. So much better. Good job, Midna. And it changed green and stays there, right? Yeah. Interesting. This looks like the pond where the spirit once was. Please, be careful. These woods have changed. The dark clouds of dusk cover this land. This drape of shadows is called twilight. In this twilight, those who live in the light become as mere spirits. It is a place where the dark ones and evil creatures dwell. I probably just always click so I can read faster. <laughs> I am a spirit of light. Blue-eyed beast, look for my light. Retrieve the light stolen by the dark beasts and keep it in this vessel. You got the vessel of light. It's crucial to collecting the tears of light. If you fill it with tears of light, you will be able to cut through the twilight and return normal light to its place. To see these evils that hold the tears of light, use your X senses. Sounds good, and we can also see them on a the map. In the shadows of twilight, the dark insects are invisible, as invisible as normal beings are here. Let me use the last of my power to reveal the locations of the dark insects that consume the light. Yeah, we can see them on a the map a little bit, these little dots down there, so that's useful. But we do have to use our senses to actually see them. Find the insects of darkness. The dark insects, they are the form of, taken by evil. Once it has latched onto our scatter light. Sounds good. We have a quest. Now if I like read it very slowly, it sounds like that uh, like the guy from Malcolm in the Middle in the wheelchair. Who always has to breathe after like three words. But anyway, I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Next time we will collect the uh, the light in this area. And maybe turn back into human form? I don't know. Midna might know. We shall see. What are you guys looking at? Oh. Nothing. And nothing. That's why I don't dig. Anyway, guys. <laughs> thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Goodbye.